Well, I'm ready to go. Um, everything's all packed in the backpack. I'm ready to head out. Uh, did a quick police around the area and saw that everything was all picked up. So down the trail that way. I think Shug did a cool educational thing showing people what's in his pack. Kind of inspired me to do this as well. Or for my family and so they could see what I'm bringing along and my friends who think I'm a little cuckoo. Well, I'm back from the trip and I just wanted to show everybody what was in my pack. Um, start off with this jacket. Um, what's in the pockets here? Um, I carry these little smart wool um, lightweight uh, knit gloves. This pocket here, I've got uh, my prescription sunglasses. Uh, I've got my black rock um, hat and a pair of wristies here. And there's the jacket itself. I, I will REI um, soft shell jacket. Uh, next thing are my uh, my poles here. Um, these are uh, Comperdell um, carbon uh, C3 compact. They're 12 ounces uh, together. Then I carry a uh, a uh, ULA Ohm uh, pack. And, you know, it's got a more room in it than you'd expect. Um, I've got a water jug here and a water jug here on the outside of my pack. I carry, um, usually I carry two. And also for more water um, on the trail, I find this thing super handy. Um, it's a um, uh, aquastar.com, UV aquastar.com, um, ultraviolet light, uh, ultraviolet C. And what it does is you press this little button and wham, um, you've got this um, ultraviolet light that denatures all the proteins and, and kills all the uh, critters that are in the water. Fuel wise, um, I, I carry, um, for this trip I carried this heat um, for uh, an M5 stove, I'll show you that later. Um, it's in my pack. More on the outside of my pack here. Um, this is a, a 10 car rod. Um, it's got flies and extra line and uh, some uh, tippet material and some and then the Takara rod in here. The whole fishing package, the whole, I mean, this is my whole fishing kit. Um, it weighs eight ounces. Um, still on the outside of the pack here, I, I have a little pack towel that I cut in half. Um, got a little thermometer. Um, it's also a compass, but it's not a very good compass, uh, but it keeps time, tells me the, the temperature. Pocket for my uh, camera that I'm filming with at the moment. And, um, and this is a uh, stick pick that I use. Um, it's a number one stick pick for those Comperdell poles. And on this side here, um, I call this thing my uh, my trail partner when I'm a GPS map uh, 62ST Garmin. I only bring this with me when I'm by myself. Knife, um, new knife for this trip, um, and the the whole knife um, with sheath and the little fire striker. Um, weighs eight ounces. The big mesh pocket on the outside here, I, I keep it pretty full. Um, so the first thing I take out of it, find it super handy um, to have it on the outside of the, of the pack because when it's raining or if the weather is bad, I want to be able to have it on uh, pretty handy. And this is my tarp. This is stakes, uh, guy outs. Um, uh, I've got a couple extra shock cords and some M steel extenders. Uh, on here um, that I made myself with the snake skins, the tarp, the whole nine yards. This, this is uh, seven and a half ounces. A hammock gear, uh, four season, uh, Cuban fiber tarp with doors. Uh, my headlamp, it's a uh, Petzl Mayo XP. Then um, my sit pad. All right, so uh, my little poop pack, uh, outside pockets here. Um, extra batteries, little Altoids 10. Uh, I use this uh, bit of cordage. Um, to I wrap this around a tree and, and then I uh, make a little uh, uh, marlin spike hitch with a with a stick that I just find on the ground and then I hang the pack up on a tree. My iPhone and if I bring uh, head, headphones I'll bring those and I put those in there. The main compartment of the pack here. Um, and this uh, little uh, outs uh, this inside pocket here that the pack comes with. Um, I've got a, uh, a, a pack cover, cook kit, um, 
have a little mini bull design and questionable mental health uh, pot. Uh, then I've got um, a uh, titanium windscreen. Uh, you can buy titanium foil at titaniumgoat.com. My cozy for my, my pot. Um, I also from titaniumgoat.com uh, I got uh, a little titanium lid for my pot. This is a, a snow peak um, pot um, that I like, and then I can do the bottom side of the uh, cozy I made out of Reflectix. This is an aluminum spoon um, that I that I bring with me. It's a Sea to Summit mini bowl design um, uh, M5 stove, a little lighter, uh, the extra legs. I normally keep that in the pot. Uh, here's my hammock. <coughs> this little stuff sack. This is actually a peak bag uh, from 2Q to ZQ. Uh, um, and this is a, from featheredfriends.com. Vest, I love this vest. I brought an extra uh, one of these little shirts here. This is also from REI. Um, I, I like this. It actually has like uh, these little holes in the sleeves here so you can uh, put your thumb through it. And, and then when I throw the wristies on top, of this, I mean, you get kind of a really nice, warm, warm, warm wrist. And, well, this is my uh, my rain jacket. Uh, sleep socks, just a pair of fleece uh, pants. Uh, I bring it with me, but I don't always use it, and I didn't use it on this trip. This is a uh, underquilt protector by 2QZQ again, mesh sack. Uh, this is a hammock gear um, uh, winter. Uh, three-quarter underquilt of Phoenix and it's super warm and then last thing in my uh, the bottom of the pack here is uh, uh, this is a winter top quilt again by hammockgear.com lots and lots of warm so pack and all poles uh, jacket minus food minus water minus fuel uh, is 20 pounds. So getting information from hammock campers and from ultralight backpackers online I really decreased my weight. Uh, it's you know this thing it's that, it's that time of year. I'm gonna get to go fishing when the lake's frozen over. I don't know. What am I trying to say here? Lower. Lower. Lower.